Good afternoon, everybody. Naima Singletary here, BillionDollarCourage.com. Today is Monday. I believe it's May 23rd. And uh, today's topic is going to be go where your irritation is. Go where your agitation is. Um, over the weekend, I attended an event with a group called Tribal Truth. And um, we had breakout sessions. And um, prior to the breakout sessions, um, there were presentations by the various facilitators. Um, all the present facilitators were in some way um, serving and assisting women be better, live better. Um, there was one facilitator in particular who really irritated me. Uh, for whatever reason, I was annoyed by her. <clears throat> and even though there was no obvious reason why, you know, she didn't do anything to me, she didn't say anything to me in particular, she just annoyed me. And when it was time to break out into the breakout sessions, we had to choose which group we wanted to go into. And I chose her group because she irritated me. Now, the common thing, and what I could have easily done was say, she really irritates me, she annoys me, I'm not going to her group. I don't want to have anything to do with her. But because she annoyed me, I knew, I just had a feeling that something, there was something that I could learn there by confronting the annoyance and the irritation. And so I did, I joined her group and I had a breakthrough. Um, her name is Hillary Rubin. <laughs> I don't even know if she'll how she'll feel about me saying that, but I'm saying it. And um, I'm really, really glad that I became a part of her group because um, by joining her group, I realized that I um, have more courage than I realize because I was afraid. And I told her, I said, I wanted to join your group because you irritated me. And so that was courageous. And... Um, so I'm glad I joined her group for that reason and also because I met another woman um, who was just so bright and authentic and um, I met her and then just to experience the other women in the group it was so uh, moving and honest and needed for me at that time. And so if I had avoided that group, if I had avoided Hillary Rubin, then I would not have had that breakthrough. And basically uh, breaking through that irritation and understanding what it is about her, um, because it wasn't her. That's the, when someone irritates you or something irritates you, it's not the thing that's irritating you. It's what's inside of you that's touched because of whatever it is that you're seeing or experiencing. And so it gave me the opportunity to look at myself, really. She was like a vessel to me. She helped me see myself, understand myself, um, and recognizing that I am courageous and recognizing that she had a message, she had a voice that helped to shake me up in a way that I needed to be shaken up. And if I had ran from that, I would not have had that experience. Later on, after the breakout session, uh, Hillary and facilitated a, gr a larger group um, experience where we held hands and we closed our eyes and there was a visualization of every step that we took forward there were 10,000 women behind us waiting for us to have the courage to take that step because <clears throat> excuse me when you there are people who will connect with you and will only connect with you because there's something about you that they connect with. And if you don't have the courage to take that step, there are 10,000 other women who are being held back because you don't have the guts to take the step. So what happened was we would take a step she would tell everybody to take a step and there are about 40, 45 women holding hands take, with our eyes closed, taking one step forward. And 
when you don't take this it was like a it was it was so monstrous in a beautiful way and I just cried I just cried and it was just it just felt very real to me um, because I'm afraid I am I'm afraid and there's not even any I don't know I'm just afraid and that exercise um, was another layer on top of being a part of Hillary's group so uh, Hillary if you're watching thank you very much um, and I thank myself for confronting my irritation because if I had ran from that and said she irritates me I don't want to have anything to do with her then I would not have had that experience and her her group facilitation with all of us probably would not have impacted me the same way had I not been a part of her group earlier so I want you to confront your irritation your agitation don't ignore it don't run from it don't avoid it because there is a message there for you there is power there for you um so that's the message for today short and sweet thank you very much billiondollarcourage.com you just have to take that step and address your courage look it in the eye and face it thank you